Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Al Pod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. And this is my sixth video into the NBA 2K14 tutorial series that I'm running. Now, for this, off-ball offense is a very big thing in NBA 2K14. Unlike last year where you used to get bumped at whichever way, may you go backdoor, pop out, cut, anything. It's totally different this year in NBA 2K14. So these off-ball offensive moves are definitely going to be key for you getting to the rack, cutting outside for a jumper, you know, going around screens, everything. So let's hop right into it, y'all. All right, ladies and gentlemen, off-ball offense. This is probably the most unused feature in this game, straight up. Now, to set a screen, all you want to do is get close to the defender and you'll set a screen. No problem. A lot of people don't set screens. Me, myself, I set a lot of screens. Now, a standing juke, all you want to do is tap the right stick left or right. All right? He'll do it automatically. Now, a standing juke really works because it'll get the defender cheating to the inside, and then you can just either go the other way. Now, a standing double juke is the same thing. You just go left, then right. So, left, right. All right? Up. Oh. I guess he don't want to do it. There you go. You know what I'm saying? See him get low? He basically tries to shake the defender. Really, really cool. Now, juke launch, one of my favorite things. From Stan, you just want to move the right stick right and then hold it left. So, just hold and then you go. All right? When you do that, you basically send the defender right and then you launch left and you create space. Now, a spin launch, somewhat of the same thing. But you just have to rotate the right stick in a half circle. And then when you do, he'll spin and go cut to the rim. That right there for alley-oops is probably one of the best moves in the world. I'm going to show you one last time. I got to show you again. Just look how easy you go to the rim. like, And just imagine if number 99 just wanted to throw it. Dang, it would have been a beautiful play. But next thing we're going to look at the, is the stutter launch. Now from the stand, you want to tap the right stick twice and then hold it. So you do it and then you go. All right, real easy. All you do is tap and then you hold. Now, the next thing we're going to do is a stutter cut. All right, St you got to start running forward, right? And then you tap the right stick left to right. Now, what this helps with is if you want to pop out around a screen. A lot of people just think that they can just run their guy around screens like that. No, it doesn't work that way. What you want to do is you want to run and then tap this. See that? See, see that? That is a beautiful play because what happens is now you're in the flow of offense. Now you have a quicker way to get around those screens down low. Very beautiful. Now, juke cut, all you do is run. Then when you run, you just tap the right stick left, then right, which means you could fake them and then go the other way. All right, so let's do it. Tap and then go. I uh, guess he didn't want to do it there. <laughs> left and right. All right. See that? That that was supposed to do it. Come on, 2K. I'm doing it. I'm doing the moves you want me to do. I guess they don't want me to do it. Alright. Alright, I guess I guess <laughs> I guess they was being real tricky with it. But let me try it one more time. Alright. Let me start running and then tap the right stick left and right. Alright, cool. There we go. Now, what that does is when you run inside, you basically fake the defender thinking you're going to go around the screen and then you go the opposite way. Now, the last move on this list is a spin cut. All you do is while running, just rotate it in a half circle and he'll, whoa, what the heck did you do, buddy? There you go. Peep that. Did you guys see that? That's another quick way to get around screens. Let's look at that one more time. If somebody is setting a screen down low on the right side, and you decide to do that, whether you can rotate it whichever way, whichever uh, way you want to go. But me, I'm gonna go that way. All right, so watch. Okay, run. I guess you don't want to do it. Okay, he doesn't want to do it. <laughs> All right, there you go. I guess they don't want to do it. All right, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, this is IKC signing out. Hopefully this helped you out a lot. The, the go-to moves when playing against people is the stand double juke, the juke launch, the double juke launch, the spin launch, the stutter launch, and the stutter cut. These moves are perfect. They help you out a whole lot. 
But uh, this is IKC signing out. My next video will be on all ball defense. Ooh, I can't wait to talk to y'all about that. But I'm going to holler at y'all in the next video. Peace. This is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode, click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC, click subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.